Hello. So today we are going to do a trail run somewhere a little bit different where we normally go. So this is in the Shropshire Hills. It's called the Stiper Stones. So we're going to plan a little eight mile route. Fingers crossed, see how we get on. We've never been here before, so we might end up getting lost. It's a lovely day though, isn't it? It is. We might even get the drone up today. Trying to get some nice shots. First time since all's water, isn't it? You wouldn't think <laughs> it's Valentine's Day, because it's just... Beautiful. Yeah, it's a nice Valentine's Day, isn't it? It is, blue sky. Well, let's see how it goes. So I've actually changed the way we're doing things at the moment because we're training for the All's Water 20 next, this year in June. We've already done the route. We did a recce on the route, but uh, we made the cutoff times okay, but we want to do it better. And we want to uh, enjoy it a bit more than what we did last time because we found it quite tough, well, I did anyway. So we've been doing a lot of hill work. We've been using the Reekin, which is our local hill. You can just see the Reekin just in the very distance there. Been using the Reek in our local hill as a good training ground. We're getting some good elevation on there now. But we thought we'd come over to the other side of Church Stretton today and give this route a um, a bit of a, a go. I must admit, what we've seen so far is absolutely stunning. We're so lucky to have this on our doorstep. There's always Bob. It's everywhere. It's got a bit of everything this route. Bogs, boulders. So this route we've picked is a uh, figure of eight and uh, you can see where we're heading for now. We'll go straight over here, down the other side and come back around the right hand side of it and then up onto the top where the Stiper Stone Summit is. It's an ideal day, isn't it? I hope this camera's picking up the views. Yeah, we're just picking up the Reekin in the far distance, and then over to the right is the Long Mind Church Stretton. It's a bit hazy, but it's a lovely day for trail running, isn't it? God, I don't think it's February. Yeah, that's the first loop completed. I will turn left, start to head up to Stiper Sands. <laughs> I 
Wow. Yeah, there's the summit stone there, look. Yeah. You okay? Yeah. Well, we're on the top now, it's getting a bit breezy. It's quite difficult to run on this, is, isn't it, Karen? Yeah. Wow, yeah, we're turning into a bit of a walk at the moment. We're just catching the um, clag coming in, it's quite impressive. Right. All the sunshine's gone. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> Get you. It'll come back out again. <laughs> this is really, really difficult to get over this ground. Oh. Pointed, jagged, really uneven. That's impressive though, look. Oh nice just blowing across the top. Oh. We've managed to get the drone up, although it's a very short time. It's very hazy. Well, now you can't see anything. This route's got a bit of everything, hasn't it, Karen? Yeah, walking. Walking, chatting to friends from work that we haven't seen for ages. Running on boulders, going into bog. That was that's really difficult to run on. Yeah. Really, even to just walk over it was awful. That was. I mean, we're not novices, are we? <laughs> but bloody hell, that was awful. This is better. For, yeah, a good mile and a half, unrunnable, jagged rocks sticking out everywhere. Well, it's a bit better now, we're enjoying it again. It's a bit misty over Wales Way, look. It's lovely, isn't it? Yeah. So we've just come off the Stipe of Stones and now we're on this nice grassy section where we can actually run for a while we'll just do this loop and then back to the car Same on the ground from the um, top of the Stipe Stones. Makes a difference when you're running on brick ends. Nice leafy trail, isn't it? That's the last loop done and the last climb. That's knackered me up. Wow. Dropped all the height to go back up again. Always a clever thing to do. It's 
So we're back in the woods again, heading back towards that larger grass section. Get a good view of the Stuyvesant Summit on the way back. And we're just going to turn right and head back to the car park. About a, about a mile to go, I would have thought. It's very rocky on the top of the Stuyvesant. When I mean rocky, I mean awkward to run on. It's very awkward to run on. So you need to bear that in mind if you're coming up here. Well, these other trails we've been on, either side of it, have been brilliant. Well, we've got a welcoming committee. We're going to get shot on. We're going to get shot on, on the last bit of the run. As the farmers and had started to book spread all over us. <laughs> hey! <laughs> We just made it in time. Right. Right. Yeah. Well, we're back at the car park now. We clocked up 8.5 as we thought. It's a great route, it's full of everything, but going over to the top of the Stipe Stones is. Um, it's very, very bad underfoot, really. But it's well worth giving it a visit. We've enjoyed it, hope you have too.